Dependable, dependable God It doesn't matter what comes my way You are still God yeah. Intentional, intentional God Everything is working out for my good Dependable, dependable God It doesn't matter what comes my way You are still God yeah, yeah. Intentional, intentional God Everything is working out for my good Uh, you love me too much, oh, too much, oh, too much, oh, excess love, oh. Uh, you love me too much, oh, you love me too much, oh, excess love, oh. Unconditionally, Lord, thank you for loving me too much. Lord. Thank you for loving me too much. Lord. Unconditionally, thank you for loving me too much. Lord. Thank you for loving me. Where would I have been? Where would I have been without you? You love me too much, oh. Oh, Kakame, Nahim, you be. You are A to Z, and everything in between, no. Oh. I'm a mama, mama, yo. Now you be the most high king. Eche top ye zike. Odiro ye di kaki. Ama mama siya masyo. Now you be the most high king. Eche top ye zike. Odiro ye di kaki. Now I'm standing here only because you made. Now I'm standing here only because you made. Now I'm standing here only because you made a way. Hello there, I'm Tony Mensa, and I wear bow ties. I'm a realtor in Washington, D.C. I've got numerous uh, compliments on my different bow ties, and then the, the biggest question is, how do you tie a bow tie? Well, today I'm going to teach you. Two flaps, bow tie untied. Uh, first thing we do is we cross the bow tie, flip it underneath, and pull it straight out. Now, this piece is coming over the top. You want to keep it up. And the one on the bottom, here, you want to pull it across like so. Then drop the piece back down. Wow, you almost have the bow tie. Pull these two flaps together, leaving the one in the back free. Now on the side, you'll see you have a little keyhole here. That's where you're going to pull this part of the bow tie through and push it in through that keyhole. It, you may need to tug on it a little bit, but once you get it in there, it's in there. Pull it through on the opposite end, and here, let's pull this flap out the way. You pull the bow tie completely through. This is the back side of your bow tie. 
So once you pull it through, now you can let it go. Shape that tie, shape the front, and you're done. Uh, besides that, all you have to do is put your collar back now and shape your tie. Uh, this will work for any kind of tie that you can buy. And my recommendations is don't buy your ties from the expensive men's stores. You can find them at um, discount stores. You really have to get out there and look for them. Always buy good ties because you'll tie these things over and over again. You can wash them, but I recommend that you dry clean your bow ties. Bow ties will last you much longer than a regular tie because you don't have something hanging in front of you. It's up. Uh, the, only, the only way it's going to get dirty is if you're sweating from your chin and you sweat on it. But you don't have to worry about leaning over something and your tie going into destroying a good tie. If you buy a good tie, tie it tight. When you're done, at the end of the day, take it loose. Steam iron it on the backhand side of the tie in which you tie it. My name is Tony Mensa, the bow tie wearing realtor. Please do me a favor. Like this video if you like it. Tell somebody, say, forever's a long time. Say, but God loves you that long. God says, I'll be committed.
said, I'm going to be by your side. Hey, guys. I'm here, and today is Mommy Appreciation Day. And we're giving Mommy roses. So we got this little bunch. I'm going to take this upstairs to her to see where her reaction is. Did you give your mom her rose? Yes. What did she say? Mm -hmm. Okay. So now it's daddy's turn. We're going up the stairs. Catch her off guard. Face the fun things you do to stay married. Okay. Hey, mommy. These are for you. It's Mommy Appreciation Day. Oh, okay. You got the, the big old bodacious thing going on there. Oh, Mommy Appreciation Day? Yeah. Oh. Tomorrow's Daddy Appreciation Day. What's up? Okay, I love it. I can okay, see you guys. God provides. So why do I worry about my life? When you come to my rescue a thousand times Every other voice it is a lie God provides God provides In ways I can't explain and can't deny The little that I have he multiplies just when I feel he won't show up on time, God provides. He'll come through when the clouds of doubt rain down on you and test everything you thought you knew. Now you finally see what God can do for you. So tonight, close your eyes, there's no more need to fight, watch God provide, God provides, it's hard to say when there's no food to eat. Oh, what you see feels all that life will be And will this be another year of misery for me? But my faith can't survive on just things I see God provide, yeah. He will provide before your eyes. Oh, He will, He will. So tonight, close your eyes. There's no more need to.
tonight Close your eyes, there's no more need to fight Watch God provide PickMeDC.com and I've been away for the last three weeks so you haven't seen my tip of the week but I want to give a tip out today because it's a new year. Enjoy your time with your family and friends and make this a very prosperous year. This is my tip of the week. Happy New Year. Must have been cold there in my shadow to never have sunlight on your face. You were content to let me shine. That's your way. You always want. A step behind uh, See, I was the one with all the glory While you were the one with all the strength Yes, you Only a face without a name I never once heard you complain no, no. Did you ever know that you're my hero? You're everything I would like Beneath my wings 
Taking the trip, Mr. Mensa. I'm headed to the motherland, back to where it started. There's my, my sibling, <laughs> Mama, sister. We are at the airport. Going to celebrate, Daddy. Yeah. We're going to celebrate Jonas Mensa, Uncle Taiwo. To some of you. Yeah. All right. So okay. see you guys. Thank you, Arlene. Hey, See you guys. She, she, as soon as she, uh, she be on it. I know she was on there. She, she worked from home. That's why. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. See you guys. Than I am right now Wasn't holding you up So there's nothing I can do To let you down It doesn't take a trophy To make you proud I'll never be more loved Than I am right now Ooh. Going through a storm So why would it drown? You've never been closer than you are right now. Let's sing it all, y'all. You are Jaira. You are in love. Jaira. You are in love. And I will be content. I can see so clear what it's all about So stay by my side When the sun goes down Don't want to forget how I feel right now Hi, I'm Antoine the Realtor and this is one of my tips. Some of the things that break my heart is when you're selling someone a home and you ask them if they want a home inspection and they tell you no. Home inspections are very important because home inspectors capture items 
that are not normally known to the average individual. We're gonna take a look at this home here. This is a home that was completely burned out and it breaks my heart when I drove by and saw this home a few days ago. But it leads to the thought that if I don't know what happened here or if it was the instance of a bad uh, electrical outlet or if it was something smoking or what it may have been. But these folks lost their their ability to live in their lovely home. This is a fantastic community. I ride my bike through this community on a regular basis and I must stress the fact that homeowners insurance is important. Um, it will replace the home but a home inspection is more important when you're purchasing because you can't re replace individuals. I'm Antoine the Realtor. I'm licensed in Maryland, D.C. and Virginia and I'll put a link down below for my home inspector and for the insurance company that I use. I use Amica and I have two home inspectors that I use on a regular basis and I'll put them down in the link as well. You guys go out there and buy plenty of homes and have a good time. I'm Antoine the Realtor.
Toi, 